Hawkard Systems is excited to introduce new features from Camworks 2015. This video will show you a quick preview of the new multi-surface feature that can select faces of a particular color. This enhancement can greatly reduce programming time and help automate the task of selecting multiple groups of faces. So I've added a stock setup on this part and a new mill part setup. So I'm going to right click on the mill part setup and add in a new multi-surface feature. And under feature type you'll now see faces by color. So I'll choose that and I don't want to define it as an avoid feature so we'll leave that unchecked. And I've created a strategy for this part so I want to use my four axis rough finish strategy. And I'm going to choose the red surfaces to apply my toolpath to. So I'll generate the operation plan and you'll now see I have my roughing and my finishing toolpaths. So we'll right click on the roughing operation, edit the definition, and I've chosen my pattern to be flow line between surfaces. So between the two surfaces, we're going to create a flow line toolpath. So I need to choose my upper. So we'll create new features for this and we can also use the faces by color option. This time we're going to define as the avoid feature. So my upper is going to be the dark gray color. And we can add in the lower feature as well at this time. So we can choose the light gray color. So we'll check off the upper. And now we can check the lower. And we'll press OK and we can generate our roughing toolpath. And you'll notice as soon as the message window closes, the process manager is going to open. And when that opens, we can actually edit the finishing toolpath while this is doing its job. So we can edit the definition. And we're going to choose upper and lower for this as well. The same selections. And press OK. Now we can generate our finishing toolpath. You'll notice that I had my colors added to the part before I added any toolpaths. So we want to make sure that in SolidWorks before we create uh, color features that we add colors to our SolidWorks part. Okay, so now we've got our roughing toolpath and our finishing toolpath. If I come back into the feature tree and edit the first feature that I created, You'll notice when I choose my strategy that we now have a new operations for matching condition in technology database window that shows up on the right hand side. So you'll see the two operations that are associated with this strategy. I have a multi-axis mill one and two. The first one's the roughing and the second one's the finishing toolpath. So you can also access the technology database by clicking the button inside this window. So these are just a sample of some of the many new features that will be available in Camworks 2015. Please see the Hawkard Systems website for more information on Camworks 2015.